Hey, welcome in, guys. We will be playing something else. I know it's a joke. I mean, <laughs> we needed to show you some fight for Final Fantasy VI Brave New World, and it's uh, a hack that I'm playing for Retro Achievements. And I thought that uh, showing you one of the super bosses uh, of the game with a certain uh, strategy would be certainly interesting. So here is my game uh, in the world of Ruin. So I'm just at the beginning with uh, Silesh. And uh, here is my game, my run at the floating continent. <clears throat> Sorry. So that is my team right now. Um, let's say that uh, Mog, Setzer and Shadow will mostly be there for, let's say, healing or supporting. Yeah, that's the main uh, that's the main goal here uh, so here is what we have i really worked a lot to make sure that i had a, i mean the most out of the game so it's like uh, we farmed a lot whether it was for money or you know items uh, i tried to find uh, all the um the secret ones you know behind the walls somewhere so i know pretty much the game so we should have most if not all the items that we could get so far i don't know uh, if we could miss some but i think that we're pretty much 100 percent uh i was trying to buy four or five weapons of each kind so we are there for uh, let's say go go so we can use everything that we want of course the most that we can same for the armors four of them at least so um, when we have more than one party uh, i just unequip some and I equip the others, so it's not a problem uh, if, if we need to do that. Yeah, so that's what we have. And uh, when it comes to the... Um, here you can see those are the, um, the relics. Uh, nine of them, you know, it's like I like to have them in order. So uh, I, eight would be enough, but nine is it's just that, that uh, the order will remain the same. I like when it looks like this. You, you see that they were placed in a certain order <laughs> so they look great <laughs> i just love it here um so that's what we have so far that's our equipment uh, nothing huge i mean uh, sprint shoes for everybody and wall ring wall ring i think um, well let me see here what it does Yeah, it's auto shell. Uh, it's it's for protection, of course, against magic. I don't know if it makes a difference in the fight, but uh, yes. Uh, so let's go. Let's go see what it, what we can do. And of course, at that point, uh, we just run the fights. We don't need um, the money or the XP. What hurts here is certainly the fact that we can't really... Um... Oh, yes, I can at least run. Yeah, uh, but uh, no fast forward here. <laughs> Not like when I'm playing uh, on Retro Arc. So I hope that you are hearing me, guys. I don't know. Uh, everything seems to be quiet. I hope that everything is okay with the stream. Seems to be okay here. I see the sound. Here, you're just fine. Okay, hey, hello, solidification. Welcome in. Nice. Okay, so thanks for telling me. I will know. So everything is fine. Okay, let's go. Let's go. So um, we could lose the fight, of course, because um, it's a matter of RNG, of course. I will start by attacking, but after that, I will wait with Setzer and Shadow. So if something occurs, I will use potions and stuff. I will see uh, how it goes, or even uh, the slots with Setzer, of course. So throwing uh, shurikens, I thought it was a good uh, good idea. Yeah, I'm just doing things quickly here. Um, last time that I tried, I think it was this morning, I tried with the uh, Earth Blues, and uh, I think it doesn't do, uh, you know, the healing spell enough. I think Wind Song is the best one, I think, for here. Uh, I should have looked before the fight, you know. Could lose the fight oh, with this party, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, of course. Yes. Yeah, it's it's like we will use brutal force. We we just show a certain way to fight, but step mine is my weapon here. 
if we are lucky <laughs> you see the damage there if you go into the dance menu yeah yeah i know i know i just didn't remember per, by heart you know uh okay let's heal here i need um, to play it safe for as long as i can i will use oh wind slash again yeah yeah it's like uh, no healing for now but mug is the savior so sometimes Okay, that's good. For as long as uh, my guys survive. So, two step mine uh, landed. <laughs> yeah, if it has 50%, I think it's better than uh, the, the blues one. <laughs> Let me see here. Meteo. Yeah, we'll probably have to heal somebody here. Uh, okay. Oh, Sunbat, yeah, thanks, thanks, that's what we were looking for. We don't mind if I heal instead of attacking with Shadow or Setzer. Go is our... Yeah, now I will wait because we are winning the fight um, for now at least. But now things will probably change. Yeah, I'm feeling it right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm just waiting here. Because Go and Mug are automated, so we don't need to worry about it. Okay, now Go starts to be confused. Don't cast Vanish, man. <laughs> we don't need it. <laughs> uh, the Sunlight thing heal... Oh, the wind sound. Okay, interesting. So here, no choice. I will uh, heal myself. Let's use potions again. Probably on Go. Bye, Shadow. <laughs> no, I think it's the same uh, damage for everybody. So if we are only three people, we're in deep trouble. But uh, with four people alive, I think the damage is split between the guys. So it's um, we have a better chance when, when it's uh, this way. Wow, Setzer, step mine. Keep going, go. You can do it. Full power, oh nice. I like when we defend against uh, those things. Looks great. For now, we, we have pretty much the perfect fight. We were lucky with everything. Uh, but now, of course, it targets go. <laughs> Which is not good. Uh, depends on what Mug will do here. Razor Leaf, what's that? What? Just about to notify you, yeah. Step mine, nice. Was well, just about to notify you uh, yet here, are you? Oh yes, hello Climax. Uh, goodness, I was slow there. Uh, what did he do? Okay, I will still try the potion, nonetheless. Hey, hello Climax, welcome in, by the way. Sorry, I'm concentrated on the fight. <laughs> just want to win. I think that one more step mine. Nah, goodness, superb. There is just Setzer. I think he's stunned right now. That reddish, reddish light. We're, yes, we're just a few people right now, but it's um, it's fine. So I will use a remedy on Setzer, I guess. Yeah, we need all my people. Oh, okay, he's back. Okay, so a potion will be good. Uh, no, okay, I thought it was back. I, it's just because I saw him move. <laughs> At least he will survive. Okay. So Remedy would have been perfect here, but uh, well, who knew? Goodness, Kaon! Two years and one month. 25 months. Thanks a lot for the support, Kaon. Good stuff. And another step mine, which is also good stuff. Hey, that was not enough. I, I thought that the fight was over, guys. <laughs> Thanks again, Kian. Oh, goodness. Shadow will die. Uh, me? B? No, he will die. Okay. okay Sunbat is welcome here. But now uh, I can't do nothing. <laughs> oh, yes, I can. Okay, nice. Um, I will wait to use the Phoenix down just before... Uh, Mug does something. Let's see if it works. Yeah, 
It's just a matter of what Go will do because one more step mine and we, we win the fight, uh, in my opinion. Win slash, okay. Or maybe Mug will just complete the job. <laughs> Let's see here. Flare. Ah, that's good. He attacks uh, the people with high HP, so we're still okay. Oh, he could mess. A step mine. Excellent, excellent. So, yes, it can be done, and uh, I don't think that my strategy was, well, um, I mean, the strategy was not uh, deep. It was just about, you know, farming steps for step mine. <laughs> So that was my plan. I, I knew that it w it would land. I I, I saw it uh, the first time that I got there and I got smashed, of course. So uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah, we won. I think I will um, make a video for it and I will share it on the on the page so people maybe will have more hopes, you know, about this fight. Because yeah, of course uh, I can show it again. We're almost uh, half a million steps and uh, two million gold, but the gold it was more for you know preventing. I just wanted to have gold when we enter the next world. So of course my time uh, is over 100 hours. Kion, if it tells you something. <laughs> hey, okay, I can show again what we have, of course. So nothing special here. Absolutely nothing special. Switch blades for Setzer just because I wanted him to be trying to steal but he can equip better stuff you know it's uh, pretty much what it is of course the dances we have i think all the dances for now the snow one will be learned uh, later of course in the world of ruin so we have 39 rages and uh, solidification told me that it was excellent i mean uh, yeah holy crap at the gp oh but did you see the items uh, solidification that we have so far, you know, potions here, uh, 99 potions, they are 2,000 gold pieces each. So that was a good uh, 200,000 right there. And uh, yeah, for the rest, it's the same. Slim Jim, I stole 99 of them. Same for the warp whistles. Uh, the rest, I think I bought it. The Red Bulls, um, I think we could steal them, but I, I think I bought uh, I bought them at the end of the day. Gumpod that was stolen, but uh, you know everybody will not, will get 99, of course. Yeah, um, and of course I bought a lot of uh, scrolls and smoke bombs just to make sure, of course, shurikens. And uh, for the rest, uh, four weapons, if not five, sometimes eight or nine, of course, depending on. Uh, if they were useful and how how many people could use them also so uh, yes i really worked hard so we will have more stuff for when we re reach the, um, the colosseum because i don't know what we will see there so having more weapons than needed i think or, or armors or um, relics i think it will be good it won't it won't hurt and and I, i'm a treasure hunter so that's that's an, another proof <laughs> Of course, so that shows pretty much what we have now the relics, which is the last uh, Thing that we can show here in the inventory Inventoring and of course uh, that my weapon that we just got so a normal person <laughs> Fewer than 20 hours approach is ice abuse. Yeah, selection shadow can use this spell When Atma is gaining power, okay, that, that's interesting because I wouldn't think about casting this spell for that kind of stuff from um, even from Atma because it's like to me it was unstoppable in my opinion so that's good to know so I, I'm learning here so I go Selesh and then anyone with some ice magic yeah go with Stray Cat uh, will decimate Atma with Ice 2 and Snowball oh yes and by the way we have no no magic you know uh, if you want the proof we have absolutely no magic there is just Shadow earlier that, who had um, oops he had life tree of course he learned it from the mementoring just like realm did but you don't have uh, 99 uh, elemental rods oh yeah that's true solidification you have a you got a point there because we can use them of course but i, I never never think about those things i used my first thunder rod uh, maybe not by accident but certainly when i was testing 
and of course I just reset I just I, I didn't know that we could buy more later Selesh would learn this spell normally by leveling up yeah I think level 15 natural magic is allowed by the set I think so climax but um, I didn't want to touch the espers at all it's like when I open that door here I would always reset after that I didn't want to make any mistake because for me if I did that just like this, like it here, my run was over. I, I didn't want to touch. I, I, we never know, you know, when we don't know, we don't take any chance. At least I don't. So that's what I did. So, that, so that's why I farm steps. I didn't want to use any magic. And I, I just saw that when we got smashed by Atma, that my uh, much less powerful step mine was still landing. So I said, let's try it. And I, I had great hopes that it would help and here it didn't lie so that was very fun okay hey, that was it for Final Fantasy 6 guys I hope that you enjoyed and I'm glad that uh, we won the fight uh, you know with the first in the first try because uh, well I tried it only once this morning just to to make sure that the controls were okay and uh, no th that was not going well <laughs> that's the truth that's just what happened there Okay, more NES games now. Uh, what will we be playing today? Uh, I will go with uh, certain games with stages. Let's go with uh, Bionic Commando, let's say. Uh, let me see here. Everything seems to be okay. Hey, hello, Pink Puff. Uh, welcome in. Hello and um, happy Wednesday, by the way. So let me read you solidification and you won't gain anything in, on the veil except spell points to learn magics Which is 100% okay my guide and uh, what I do is based around that. Okay Nice. Thanks for telling me again So I can learn magic for both runs and there is no problem. I Think you have a very hard time ahead of you in the world of ruin to be honest. Ah, it will be fun I don't mind. I mean um, we are dying all uh, very often anyway, I mean um, all the monsters have something that just kills people so I, we can't really uh, sit and you know do nothing, we really have to be careful. <laughs> but I guess with all that gold you could spam a certain little attack item, the coin toss maybe. <laughs> Happy Wednesday, thanks Pink Puff, I just got off work, oh nice, nice timing here for you. So we're in for some adventure here. Bi Bionic Commando. One of my favorite games. That's the second game that I bought in my life. But I'm, I will probably be rusty. <laughs> yeah, gonna drop up, uh, drop off. Thanks for showing uh, me the atma. Hey, that's a pleasure solidification. Thanks for stopping by and everything. So uh, I will keep you, uh, of course, informed. Gonna lurk and cook supper. Yes, Pink Puff, of course. So uh, have a good time for now. Yeah, just showed uh, a little bit of Final Fantasy VI, Brave New World, uh, Pink Puff, when we started, and it that was uh, <laughs> that was something, something special. <laughs> hey, how are you, Keon? By the way, what are you doing? And are you thinking about streaming today? Goodness. Bionic Commando is the second game I played. Wow! And it's the second game that I bought. The first one was Castlevania 2. Okay, so you know about Bionic Commando. That's interesting, Climax. First game being Super Mario Bros. 1 and Duck Hunt. Yeah. Nice. Yeah, me too, but just uh, Super Mario Brother Brothers 1. I was in a trip when uh, when it when it happened. Ah, of course. Doing well. I'm working now. I'm a bit behind for work this week, so I need to buckle down and work hard. Yes, but I'm going to stream tonight. Metal Mech game of the month. Nice, Kian. Nice. So you will be there. Uh, where are we going here? For a long time, I didn't realize you could farm and get levels and HP. Oh yeah, and in Bionic Commando, you mean probably uh, Climax? Yeah. Yeah, my farming spot is right here uh, in this stage. 
My my key, the way I I play the game, I press down a lot when I'm uh, in the airs. Pressing down gives you a control that uh, you know. Uh, now I'm a little bit rusty with it, but it, it helps doing moves that uh, people are not used to see, and it, it's uh, it's nice. Yeah, that's my spot here. It's like uh, I kill two of them. I think I stay here. Yeah, like this. Um, I'm not sure if the if we can get three of them. Many health points in the first area. Yeah, exactly. We can farm anywhere. We can come back, of course. We can complete stages and come back. Hoping to beat Metal Mech tonight. Nice, Keod. I wish that you can do. And uh, what would be next, by the way, Keod? Do we know? I didn't take a look at that. Hey, too slow there. <laughs> So here, of course, you can see the list of the games that I will be playing this week on um, on Discord, and uh, the list, I mean, uh, is shrinking every day. I just uh, do a new screenshot when I get new. I mean, uh, when uh, there is games that are completed on my list. But yes, we will try to complete them all this week. I don't know actually, I think someone won a raffle, okay yes for the next game, uh, at some point and put Gyro Might uh, in the, into the mix, okay, interesting Kian, so could be it, so so you need to, to, to check I guess Kian, but I will have to make sure my ROB, the robot works, um, Gyro Might, yeah I, I don't know about that uh, Kian, is it something that... Uh, same robot that uh, Megatron showed at some point. I don't know what it is. <laughs> I just don't know. That's why I'm not sure. <laughs> For Rob the robot is the accessory that is used for Gyromite. Ah, okay. I will get. I will have to see. So I guess that you will place your cams in a certain way. A new way, maybe, Keon? Is it what it means? Climax has held on your. It's the Trojan horse that Nintendo used to get the retail retailers to carry game consoles after the market crashed in US and Canada. Hmm. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We will see, we will see when it's it's ready. <laughs> um, I can't picture what it looks like. I make sure everyone can see the robot and uh, I have to make sure the robot actually works. Okay. But when it works, wh what's the deal with it? Is it that it only moves or do you need it to be connected in a certain way so it will help you play the game? I, I'm, I'm lost there, I don't know uh, what's, the, what's the deal with the robot. Or is it just for fun? Or maybe it does sounds that help you with the game. Um, yeah, I'm very... I don't know. So I'm curious, of course. Hey, 25 months, Kian. That's, that's my age as a streamer as well. Rob connects to the NES controller, okay. Through the controller port. Uh, the robot actually presses the buttons of a controller. Okay. It presses two key buttons for you in a convoluted key, key way. <laughs> okay. But are you playing with another player, um, virtual player, when you play uh, Gyromite? Isn't Gyromite um, um, a chopper game? With an helicopter or something like that. That's what it tells me. Uh, because I think I played this one on um, maybe uh, 260 games in one cartridge. But I might be conf confused with another game. But I think I played that. Okay, it's not the helicopter game. Ah, okay. But I think it had the same name. 
<coughs> it's basically a mini accessory, not unlike the power glove. Yeah, okay, yeah, power glove. But without even the power glove supported game library. Okay, library. Okay. It's like an old science man running around. <laughs> yeah, Einstein. <laughs> but it's a robot. Pardon him. Uh, my god, he's a robot from the future. My father, yeah. I was looking at some... Um, it was a parody with uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger and uh, Jesus. It was fun. <clears throat> you know, uh, the Terminator went into the past to try to save Jesus from the Romans. So that was very funny. <laughs> it's, uh, it's a short video that it's easy. It's probably easy to find it on YouTube. That was funny. Okay, um, I will go for 6. 6 HP here. Then I think that we will have uh, more than enough power. We, we can get more, of course, uh, when we complete the stages. Okay, and so if the robot is not working correctly, I would then be able to play the game the way that it wants you to play it. And uh, you know me, <laughs> I'm all about genuine playthroughs. Yeah, okay, so you want the robot to work. Okay, let's go, guys. Let's go challenge those guys here. You think you can destroy the main system? You have no chance! Oh, really? Okay. Ah, die! That's pretty much it for the first stage. <laughs> yeah, the, the, um, in general, the bosses are not bad in this game. I mean, it's... Uh, that was a cool game, it's not uh, ultra difficult, and we can have uh, infinite continues if we want. Uh, you see them, let's see the enemy, the, the greenish trucks. We can get uh, free continues from them. I hope I will be, uh, I will be using the right communicators. Oh, that's another something there. Because we can get... Can we get stuck in, in in some stages if we don't have the right common indicator? I think that it would just mean uh, getting being game over, I guess. Yeah, I think I think that's the the reality of the thing here. So let's go. <clears throat> I remember when uh, Ulcer Grind uh, gave me the, the challenge of beating this game the Deathless. That was fun. Took us uh, at least two tries. First try, uh, we got to the end. But uh, I fell. I mean, I missed the, um, the window of the chopper. <laughs> that was just meaning death, of course. But that was fun. And we need to enter some of the rooms here to speak with our friends. So the doors at the end of the stage will be open. Oh, there was a bullet up here that I missed. And it missed me too. <laughs> That's nice. <clears throat> okay, there is, a, let's call it a secret passage here. Oh no! I, ah. <laughs> I could press start to heal myself with the potion, but I, okay, I did the mistake. No, oh, so it's no more the another run. <laughs> Goodness, that was quick. I I don't know how I hit the spikes though. I was supposed to be okay. Yeah, I don't know what I did wrong. <laughs> good, good. don't see the enemies <laughs> where are you guys <clears throat> sorry you're a fool if you think you, you, you I will let you have any weapons yeah okay we will see here I like those guys we need to be quick and hit them on the back like this <coughs> oh. 
sorry. Well, how I should really go focus on work. Yes, absolutely, Kian. Uh, sorry for uh, destroying your focus here. I'm not multitasking well right now. <laughs> oh! Yes, have fun. Talk to you later. Yes, Kian. So have fun too. Uh, even if if it's for the work. Wishing you a good time, Kian. So thanks for everything again. Uh, should be streaming tomorrow as well. Oh, sorry. Here, uh, doing my things correctly. Yes, goodbye, Kian. Okay, that's a peaceful area. I mean, uh, normally, I don't want to speak with them here, so I just fire. <clears throat> oh, a life. Okay, that will be good for us here. I have one up. And a communicator. All the communicators are needed in this game. <coughs> Sorry. So. Next area will be number five. And our first enemies to the ground. And here, yeah. Nothing complicated. The top guys here, they will give you an item like this here. Take this, it means one free continue and uh, you can farm them if you want. So, um, if you know about that, <laughs> you will never, you know, you will never run out of lives in a, in a certain sense. And yeah, now we have two continues in reserve. Okay, here, don't get drowned. Is it here? Oh no, no, it's not. Uh, okay, it's a mistake. I was thinking about another um, stage, of course. <laughs> I thought that I would avoid the, the bullets in the air. So that would have been even more spectacular. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, okay. No need to speak with them. Just keep going up. I like those stages uh, when we're just going up. Nice, skip through the impossible barrels. Yeah, I know about those. Um, I know about how to get through stuff when it's possible, of course. Took me years to understand those things, but now it's uh, that makes the game so much more playable, you know. And it's very enjoyable at the same time, you know. <laughs> it's fun there. But thanks for the, the nice thought, uh, Climax. <coughs> Sorry. I think it was better if I got hit there. I think that here, when we are near, two of the bullets will hit the, the computer at the same time. So we gain time if we are close enough. Oh, rocket launcher, that's our next weapon, I guess. But uh, first thing first, let's do those smaller areas. Uh, 16, 2, 3, 6, then 14. Uh, or do we do 14 before 6? I don't remember. I don't think so. Let's see. It's been a while. <laughs> I'm totally, uh, you know, 
I know, I know in approximately what order to do the stages, which is pretty much uh, logic. Uh, but yeah, a few parts of the knowledge are missing, and it's fun. I mean, uh, it's 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 good to n not always knowing, of course. What about you, man? <clears throat> Advance with caution. I don't know if it means overall in the game or just uh, in the room where we were, I don't know. So most stages have to be completed. There is just uh, stage number 8 that uh, we don't really need to complete. Maybe 9 is not an obligation to, I'm not sure. But 8, I know that uh, there is no obligation to complete it. 8! <laughs> the sewers! I don't know if we need to enter the door here, but uh, let's try. Pretty much sure that it will not work. Yeah, not work. So hopefully the door at the end will be open. I don't understand. I, I no, I don't remember exactly which stages we absolutely need to have the right communicator. I know that in number eight, uh, red number eight, we need to have the right one. This weapon is so powerful here. Three to five hits normally against those uh, computerish things. Pendant, uh, we yes, yes, yes. Pendant is good for us. It uh, blocks one bullet, the first one that uh, we will uh, not be able to avoid in a stage or with a life. So stage number three. Let's see here. Pretty much okay. <clears throat> I think it's the way to go here. Yeah, we missed the passing, uh, the the package, <laughs> the package. <laughs> oh yeah, those flowers. Could die from them. I just want those uh, those guys to be far away so I can pretty much go without uh, thinking too much about getting eaten there. Okay, good. Made it. Okay. I will enter the door here because if we do things not correctly... Um, we would uh, probably restart up there instead of here. Okay, uh, bad. What? <laughs> okay, good, we survived. Um, I didn't have a clue how to get back to the other side. <laughs> so that was nice getting stuck there. Okay, here, don't miss. Nice. Chain spike damage, yes, and it doesn't pardon very much. That happens to me a lot, yeah. <laughs> yeah, when you do um, a no death run, of course, you don't want those things to happen too much. I don't know, Climax, if you saw my my clip that the that time when I did the no death challenge for uh, House of Grind when he redeemed it. And uh, that was fun, you know, it was, uh, I counted one, two, three, and uh, I just 
uh, fired at the, um, you know, at the chopper at the end. I don't know if you saw that that uh, that clip, but it's fun. It's fun. Okay, let's go with this power right here. For as long as we have, of course, the the rocket launcher, we're okay. Oops, missed it there. Um, I will be on the other side. Yep, if you miss your shot, you lose a life. Yeah, exa exactly. So, um, we went there twice, and the first time, I think, um... <laughs> I just said I was scared or, um, you know, um, not sure of myself or whatever. So, we, we missed it. But the next time I said, okay, no fear, let's charge, one, two, three, and boom, we, we did it. That was uh, epic, uh, in my opinion. So I don't know, I, I will show you the, um, <laughs> what it looks like. It's very fun. Uh, oh, we're dead. <laughs> oh, goodness, and we start uh, very far. Whoops. <laughs> didn't, didn't remember that it was hurting that much there. <laughs> <laughs> Goodness. But it's good, we, we're getting a few free lives here and there. The one ups, so it's not too bad. Uh, not sure if it will work here, so I will. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that was a bad move. I didn't know that there was nothing down there. Uh, here, I'm not even sure. Okay, okay, there. Okay, uh, okay, we need to be higher here. I will try to remember. So we need to do things correctly here, and I don't, I don't remember what to do. <laughs> I don't remember what to do here. I just don't remember. <laughs> oh, there was a platform there. I, I just. Oh, yes, of course you can. Uh, we're just playing for fun uh, climax. Of course, we will complete the game, but uh, yeah, tell me. Uh, <laughs> I, I, I just didn't remember where to go, so. <laughs> and missing my um, my move, so that uh, is very fun. <laughs> so help me uh, not getting smashed. <laughs> no problems, uh, climax. I will appreciate. For me, I would just stand on top of the circles. Stand on top. Oh, you mean you would do something like that? And then uh, up and... but here, I think. Ah, oh, okay, good. I use... can you move up? Yeah, okay. I understand what you mean there. <laughs> Sorry. I need to know where are the... the platforms, goodness. Yeah, it's just about knowing uh, which ones to use and which w where we can fall, in fact. Yeah, I, I forgot, so I, I, I went there and I did the same mistake. But you will fall off. You have about half a second. Yeah, when I will know where to, uh, exactly uh, where to go, it will be okay. Uh, let me see here. And yeah, we went there, there was nothing. Yeah, there is there is absolutely nothing, so I, I, I really need... So you tell, you're telling me to use the lower ones? You need to be standing on top of them. But for that I need to uh, attach to them. Okay, you mean I, I need to land on them? Like this, let's say, and... Okay, at least, okay, the, the third one is, uh, is protected if I fall under. So, okay, no problems. <laughs> I will find out. Hey, goodness, it's been a long time. Uh, but for some of them, you need to use the arm fist and then use the arm to pull yourself on top of them. Yeah. Shh. 
I'm okay. <laughs> I don't know how I made this, but okay, we did it. Whoops, uh, wrong button. <laughs> nice and dangerous. Uh, that's our last life, by the way. So we, we could have to redo uh, it all over, I guess. It's possible. And here, I don't remember at all. I know that we... Okay, here I remember what to do. Uh, it's, it just depends. Uh. Okay, we're we're all right. Okay, good. Did it. Just don't fall, and we will be all right. Okay, good. Nice. <laughs> I was a little bit worried that we could die again there. Excellent. Okay. Superb. <laughs> we will be alright. <laughs> Sorry for the bad play. Uh, yes, that can happen. I am very rusty. Not that uh, it's struggle. It's more about the lack of knowledge at that point. The rest will be okay. Yeah, because that's one of the hardest stages in the game, in my opinion. Because of that. In my opinion. But that was fun, stuff happens and uh, sometimes uh, people want to see us struggle. <laughs> that could have been the case also with, uh, sorry, with uh, Final Fantasy VI The Ray of New World today. Uh, I think everything went just too well in the fight. <coughs> but yeah, it, oops, that was fun to show the strategy though, uh, if we can call it a strategy. But yeah, I, um, I formed for what we had and it just uh, you know saved the day <laughs> yeah no no trouble with the the step mine i mean uh, that does that much damage but the uh, solidification told me that i could get even more steps so i would do 14000 damage instead of uh, 10000 uh, it will not be showed but uh, it will still do the job so that's very very interesting So that's how we can get them all, uh, because they will disappear if we wait for too long. So permit was to get the last piece of power to be enabled, to, I mean uh, to be, um, let's say, allowed to get past this place and uh, finally go to area number 8. We could do 8 uh, since we're there for fun, let's do... Uh, a 100% run. 8, 8, 8, 7. So, okay, 7 is the one. We need to do 9 before 7. Uh, I think it's the blue one. Let's try. Anyway, it's our last life, so if, if there is anything, we will just die. We will soon see if we did a mistake here. <laughs> Well, I think it's the right one, since it's the one that was needed to cross. So here we have two doors where we need to speak with uh, our people. That's what will open the door at the end of the stage. Yeah, this stage is unique. No obligation to complete the stage, but... I think it's good, yeah, I think it's good, very good to... Uh, To play this one, it's one of the best stages in the game. Lots of action. Uh, it's uh, the war here. So, where are we? Yeah, the guys with grenades. I think there is a door around here somewhere. Yeah, it's there. So that's one door, and hopefully we've got the right communicator. Excellent. So <clears throat> we can beat this one. Uh, now the other door, I think it's... If I follow the path here, I should find the door. Uh, 
Oh yeah, it's here. It's uh, in this room. I think that we could farm for lives here if we wanted to. Of course we won't, but yeah, I think uh, this package will always come if we enter the door and uh, just come back. But of course it's not a must. Hey, my package. <laughs> and there we go. Here is the door. So we're in deep trouble the way I see it here. Let's kill the leader, they will be lost. That lag. Okay. Too much stuff in the room. So I guess Climax that you were enjoying the game very much back in time. Yeah, my brothers and I, we really enjoyed this game. Uh, 19, I think it's not an obligation. But let's let's go, let's do it. Uh, Bionic Commando, uh, Climax. I got pretty far, but never beat it. Oh, really? Oh, okay. That will be in your to-do list, I guess. I was really young. Yeah. Okay, so you didn't play in years. I hear you there. So, not very important here. Yeah, it's just about... Uh, Doing the area, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what we are here for. Go ahead, kill me. Shoot me. Okay. So we will go to 9 and 17. Oh yes, and there are secrets in this game also. We will show you. Because there is the helmet. And uh, there is no path between uh, area 14 and 17 and uh, 15 and 18. But uh, we can make them appear if we speak with the right guy. And I think it's in Area 17 that we can make it happen, if we do things right. I think the one that we're looking for is this one here, but it's more for the last stages, or the last stage, I mean. Will we get the life here? Ah, it's, uh, it's very... we need to be precise, and uh, yeah, didn't make it. So we will be running with uh, our last life for a long time. <laughs> or not. <laughs> Until we die, I guess. But I don't remember too many one-ups up at uh, this point. I know that we can get the free one when we beat stage 10, I think. That hurts. Oh, the transfer Joe. Okay. Um, hey, we are almost top level already, so that's good. So we will be able to get 8 H I mean uh, HP at the end, uh, before the end. <laughs> Sorry. 
next one, 17 here. Oh yes, the three way, I think we will equip it right now, so I will not forget. Because if we, we don't have it equipped when we start Area 7, it's uh, game over, we need to reset. Uh, unless there is a way, I think, to um, exit the stages, which certainly may be a combination of uh, of buttons, but uh, if it uh, does exist, I don't know about it, and um, I don't use it. Huh! Okay, okay, I will talk on the underground paths. Yeah, okay, now we open the way between those areas. Maybe we can still use the, those ways, but uh, at least now we will see them on the map. That's what it does to uh, go on the other side of this guy here. That's uh, that's a secret, and here I don't know. Okay, prisoner of war in area seven. That's one of our next targets. But uh, one more thing: if we open the pad here, why did we do it for this secret enemy place here? That's where we can find the best bulletproof item, which is the helmet, in fact. We can see it right now. Reinishing. So the helmet is uh, the best thing that we can use to avoid damage by bullets. It uh, blocks three bullets, actually. So bulletproof for three bullets. So it's better th than the cross and also better than the bulletproof jacket, which is an item that we will find in the next stages. I don't know which one though. Maybe 11 or 7, don't remember. So here, this, yeah, let's use the helmet, should be okay. <clears throat> yeah, because those barriers, we need to destroy them with the right weapon. There are only two of them, one in stage 6 and one in stage 7, and after that, no problem. Destroy the first one with the rocket launcher, and here with the three-way... Three, uh, three uh, I don't know the, the word, three-way something, <laughs> cannon, or I, I don't remember the name of this one here, totally. Ah, nice. Okay, downfall here. That's very important. <laughs> I said downfall. <laughs> Yeah, so here it's, um, we just need to go there again when we missed it. At least we don't die. Goodness. Okay, so there is a third one. Okay. <laughs> Was not sure. Let's do it again. But now at least I think the path is clear. Those guys. Oh no. Okay. Or maybe. No, this one was still alive. No, I didn't kill it. Of course, here those guys will uh, appear non stop. Yeah, that is the one here that I always miss. Uh, too quick or too slow? Mm. That's being old, guys. You don't want to get old like me.
Absolutely. <laughs> and it's like I always do the same move. Okay, better this way then. Now, some fighting game players are getting pretty old yet still competing on a high level. Yeah, yeah, of course. No practice helps. And here I'm, uh, you know, um, I don't remember all the details uh, where to do this and that. So um, for forgetting about sometimes where the um, the blocks are, you know, I think the worst here it was more. I mean, me because of the timing was not good. But um, in stage six, I just didn't know how to proceed. So it was like. Uh, <laughs> And I think that when I did it successfully, I was lucky also. That was uh, was fun. Oh goodness! Okay, I used all my defense against the bullets. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Yes, uh, I just wanted to go see outside because it's uh, windy, very windy. And I was not sure if uh, we were to get uh, thunderstorms or stuff because uh, today it was very, very hot and humid. But no, now it's just better. The wind is uh, colder and uh, nothing that is, um, let's say, threatening in the clouds. So we're good. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> he speaks and speaks. He talks and talks, I mean. <laughs> okay, let's go. So 18, that's where we can get the famous machine gun. But we need to get it from uh, machine gunner tree. Down fire here. I think here is the first one. The heat almost makes it hard to breathe uh, in here. But I think it's getting colder, Dorvarik, though. Where is uh, the third one? I think it's the white one here. And uh, welcome in, uh, Dalvarig, by the way. Machine uh, dest uh, Destroyer 3, yeah, okay. So when we speak with the right one, we will be able to get the item. And uh, if we get it from somebody else, the item will not appear in our inventory. It took us a lot of, of time to figure out here. We were not trading well, we, we see, they said uh, Destroyer 3, but we were always speaking with Destroyer 1, so we, the, the other ones were, would not be in sight, so uh, it took us a long, a long time. Hey, let's try this super weapon. I like it here. That's where it's uh, most uh, the most interesting to use the machine gun, really. There will be enough for everybody. <laughs> okay, let's go. So area 10, 11, then 12. Uh, okay, we can get back to the our good old weapon should be good uh, I think that we only have one life yeah that's our last life we could uh, as well die here if we missed um, let's call them the jumps <laughs> yeah I think we need to be very precise here Precise and uh, no legible too, because um, could forget one move. Okay, here that was not good. Ok, 
Okay. Yeah, I know that there are spikes down there, so I try not to uh, get myself into trouble. So probably that here, the key is to do it. Okay, um, okay, there is this, so, okay, good, eee, that was almost a death there. Cool. Okay, so that's not the stage that I was looking for when it comes to precision. It's uh, 11, that's for sure. So we're fine with this one here. Do you remember Climax where you were getting stuck or something uh, with the game? But uh, if you were very young, so maybe you just needed to do all stages and you were not able to complete them because you did, a, did not complete the other ones before, so you were like stuck. It was on the, in the top right part of the map. Oh, the area 12. Okay, so you were at the end because 12 is the, is the last one. We will get there soon. So by now we have a lot of continues, that's for sure. I had the final several areas remaining. Okay, so that's the three areas, uh, probably 10, 11, 12, that we still had to complete, probably. Okay, though, so here, danger, <laughs> but it's fun. Okay, <laughs> he was mad at me, this guy. Hmm. Okay. There is the door here to the right, but I know, I'm not even sure if it's worth it. I just need to survive here. Just is a strange word here. I'm trying to get room so I can use my things correctly. Bad move here. Um, maybe we're all right. And we are, goodness, nice, did it. But uh, we might die in the last uh, stage. I think I will die on purpose because it would be bad to just get advanced into the stage and just die and uh, having to do, do, to do it all again. Yeah, bulletproof vest. So now we have all the items. So we are in a 100% run. That's the least that we can say. Uh, so now I will try to find the best way or the quickest way to die here. Uh, so now we enter this place with the best possible equipment. Let's just die. I think that uh, trying to get through the... Um, No, it's not there. It's supposed to be uh, something. Okay, yeah, this this thing here. That would be nice if we could go through it. Uh, oh, we had more more than one life remaining. Oh, okay. I didn't know. 
<laughs> but well, okay, let's still do it uh, since I started the, the process. Yeah, it's well protected. So there is no way to get through it uh, unless somebody knows exactly the pixel that is needed to do it. But uh, we will find a way. <laughs> so here, continue. Nine. We're fine. Okay. So let's do it the way it has to be done. Challenging. Challenging the place. And those electric fields. to destroy it and then uh, get out of here whoops what what did I do yeah I was just trying to get up uh, quickly that was not a good idea <laughs> okay let's go and we're, we have full power also I can see that we have uh, eight HP so we got it uh, with the stages in completing the stages I think that we get uh, 10 of those little bullets at the end of the of each stage so that gave us what we needed to level up more oh I think it was not needed to come here yeah we needed to go down totally I think so it was uh, here it was more like a trap you need to kill the guy and then you get out yeah yeah the goal is down there This one is not very complicated, we just need to do those quick, um, let's, let's say, I mean, uh, destroy those things quickly and then uh, we quickly go to where it's very important in the, in the stage. Now the path is open. Okay, here of course we need to survive the spikes. That's another scary place sometimes. But uh, that's, that was fine. Okay, good. Oh, nice. Now the best parts of the game are coming. Too late, Albatross has begun to move. Not necessary to wait for Master D to revive. I just cut off the switch for the revival device. Master D will never rise again. Will now rise again, and now it's your turn to die. What? What? <laughs> Look at this. Here is Hitler. Or. Uh, how do we call him Master D? <laughs> anyway. For me, it's Hitler. Well, I, prob I it's, prob it's probably they couldn't use the Hitler name for the, this one here. I'm pretty sure that's the, the answer. Ah, no, I was stuck there. Too bad, because everything seemed to be perfect. <laughs> no big deal, though. Yeah, again, again, that didn't go up. Uh, I think it's a bad pixel there that just doesn't want us to uh, to go up when we're in this position. Yeah, again, again, three times! Three times I thought that I was perfectly uh, set. Bad. Bad, that would have been really, really quick here. But yeah, I just need to go up one more time and uh, that will be over. And 
just because of that. Again! <laughs> That's four times! <laughs> they don't want us to grow up. Test it for yourself, it works. I mean, it, it can happen what just happened there. Four times. Normally, if there was not that kind of glitch, uh, yeah, <laughs> that's uh, it's it's fine though. But it's uh, it's funny that it happened so many times. So here, of course, we need to speak uh, with this guy. So I'm Hal. It's me. <laughs> we need to speak with him. So that's the only way that we can destroy the the cockpit here. So one, two. Three! Yes, we did it <laughs> again. <laughs> that that uh, looks like when I did it uh, in my clip, <laughs> but that was much more epic because um, I had a no that run behind of me, so there was a lot of pressure, you know. <laughs> Thanks for the GG. Yeah, here it's pretty much done. Just need to escape the base uh, in 60 seconds. We're done. Let's go for 39. <laughs> Let's go for 39. Hey, thanks for the GG, Pink Puff. Also, we appreciate. Oh, no, no, no. It's early. <laughs> it's too early to feel safe. I will kill you here. Oh, he takes more hits. Okay, oops. I said 39, but, uh, well, made me lose a little bit more time, but we will be fine. It's, uh, it's over. Hey, we're out. We're safe. Is Joe still inside? Oh goodness, let's go back inside. This guy is crazy. <laughs> what happened to the captain? We cannot wait any longer. We are going to escape now. No, please wait just a little bit longer. I mean a little longer. Hey, what's that? Yes, of course. Hey, thanks for the well done, Pink Puff. Yeah, I really like this game. Good action game, different one also, because we cannot jump, so the controls lead to something different. And very cool, I mean, uh, that, that it's cool to work with this uh, grappling something, you know, arm. Number one, oh, thanks Climax. We will be doing more missions, there is Snake's Revenge that will be coming, uh, not, not today, but yeah, it will be coming. I have time for uh, Batman, I think, uh, today. We will go for Batman, and after that we will call it a stream. Yeah, because it will be uh, dinner time soon. But now I have three days to complete 13 games, and they are not short. Willow will take time, Zelda 2 or so. Hey, Pink Puff, I, I want... Um, I want to know where you would want me to play Zelda 2, I will... I want... Um, it, it would be good if I pick a, a good time for you for Zelda 2. Is Saturday the, be the best for you or uh, maybe in the evenings, maybe uh, in the week, I don't know, or even the mornings? Wh what could be best for you? Because I know that... Um, it could be interesting since you mentioned that... Uh, you didn't complete the game, I think, something like that, so um, could be nice. But it's up to you, of course, uh, no, no obligation. I was just uh, offering you if you wanted to see more of Zelda 2. Okay, you really don't know, okay, <laughs> no problems. I've seen it finished before. Ah, okay, 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 yes. I understand, I understand. Uh, that was just in case, you know. <laughs> Okay, okay, the, the end here is coming, but I don't remember how long it lasts here. Ah, okay, it stops there. Nice. Goodbye, Joe. Let's go for Batman here. Thanks for thinking of me, though. Ah, it's a pleasure, Pink Puff. You know, uh, you guys are very cool, so uh, if there is anything, I can uh, certainly try to work something on. Uh, I mean, work something for... Uh, people who want to see a specific run or something, yeah, there is no problem. Uh, okay, Batman next. Oh, there is also Blaster Master. I just saw it in the in the list. 
Go for it. I will keep the videos playing. I like uh, to see the Batmobile. <laughs> This game. Okay. Oh, my select button is not where. It's not easy to reach it, so I I might be slower with this game here. We will see how it goes, but uh, well, no problems. We will just play it through whatever the difficulties so start is the button to use them and then select no it's not select oh I will be fine that's good I, I just thought that we needed to press select many times yeah select is not a, a button that uh, helps a lot with the controller that I have right now I mean the way it's uh, configured but uh, it's okay now I, I, it, it was a scare let's see we will be fine we don't need that button. So let's go. Let's get through the game. Yeah, Batman, uh, we have a story with this one. My uncle rent that game once when we were younger and uh, he was the one with the Nintendo so we could not... Uh, what we had was what we recorded on, in, on a video cassette. And uh, we watched it for years and years, and we could never rent the game or buy the game. It was not available, was not in the stores, and uh, there was no internet back then. So we we just dreamt about playing the game again, you know. Uh, and uh, we, um, my uncle was stuck in stage number four. He reached the cubes, the last uh, bosses of uh, stage number four. So with time and uh, with those videos, we uh, certainly had, uh, I mean, we, we prepared a strategy for when we would play the game again. <laughs> hey, hello for y'all. Yeah, that was a video, uh, that was a, yeah, on video cassette back, back, uh, back then. Hey, hello for y'all, by the way. No, you didn't do anything. I don't know, Foriel. <laughs> I don't understand your story there. <laughs> How are you, Foriel? No, my fat fingers click on your name and report. I backed out. <laughs> oh, goodness. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. I understand. I understand. Oh, goodness. Okay, why are reporting you, Pink? Yeah, okay. Yeah, you. <laughs> that's your mistake. I understand now. <laughs> Stuff happens. It's okay. I know that you're cool, so that was a. It was like, oh, there, there must be a. Um, you know, a misunderstanding somewhere. <laughs> that was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Everything is alright. <laughs> uh, if you accidentally uh, get banned, uh, guys, just come to see me on Discord and we will uh, figure it out. <laughs> we don't know sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> or come to see me on Discord. I will ban, there, ban you there as well. <laughs> it's a joke. Okay, let's go. Um, so we're already in stage number two. That's uh, that's a very short game. Five stages and uh, yeah, normally 15 minutes back in time. <laughs> it's, this game was completed just before uh, going to college. Oh, I had uh, 20 minutes. Okay, so yeah, let's play Batman and then I will go <laughs> to my uh, my class, you know, <laughs> with my books, etc. Yes, we can get through enemies when we when we hit them. Yeah, reporting Twitch Mobile. <laughs> Hit them good. Yeah, getting hit here. I knew that it was coming. Move the phone book, it doesn't leave marks. Ah, uh, yeah, of course. You see, he was going to hit the books right. I didn't say anything. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha! 
probably uh, for real. Ch check, check out for that, it's very dangerous when we hear things. <laughs> I do, but I don't tell no one here. <laughs> I speak to myself and, uh, you know, stuff like... No, it's a joke. <laughs> I can, but when I do that, uh, I'm 100%, uh, you know, I'm not uh, crazy, at least, not, uh, not, not for now, no, or not yet, nah, 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 it's okay, I'm, I'm very okay. Today was fun, um, I was supposed to stream earlier today, uh, but it was so hot uh, this day, it was, it was beautiful, uh, huge sun outside, so I said, okay, let's go train. So uh, I went to, to take a, a huge walk and also I I went to a wrestle and I just went directly into it with my shoes and uh, oh yes, uh, the water was perfect, didn't feel like it was cold and it's, uh, it's surprising uh, that maybe not that early in the month but uh, it was so cold uh, last week that it was surprising that today the, the, the waters of the wrestles were already that uh, you know that that hot uh, yeah warm or whatever i swear he said he was gonna play batman and then go to stella to say yeah that was back in time uh, for you so uh, 17 for you uh, ping puff here it was 33 in my car when i uh, went out the earlier yeah 35 yeah that <laughs> but now it's much colder it's uh, windy I feel the fresh air on my arms, uh, though I'm, I'm prob probably sweating a little, but uh, at least the wind is more, uh, you know, the, the wind is, is better, you know, uh, at least we feel some air, so it's better. But earlier there, there was nothing, so I'm, um, uh, you know, getting wet in the, in the result was good because uh, that just lowered my uh, body temperature and uh, since then I feel perfect, even if it's very uh, hot uh, outside, and now it's even better. Sweat. Or sweet, I don't know, with my pronunciation. Mine just evaporates. <laughs> yeah, of course, I understand now. Yeah, too warm, I mean, uh, too hot of a day for you. Yeah, here I'm very near my computer, so it's normal that I feel uh, feel it, and it's very humid uh, outside. I have three windows that are open at the moment, so yeah, that's uh, one of the reasons why we feel the humidity from outside. But uh, now it's very windy. I thought that we were almost getting thunderstorms, but no, it's okay. The, the atmosphere is not threatening at all. It was all beautiful when I. Uh, when I went out uh, this afternoon and it's, it's still this way a little bit more uh, cloudy but nothing huge just uh, colder temperature you know and it's uh, it's a blessing <laughs> sweat uh, rhymes with wet uh, doesn't rhyme with uh, wheat <laughs> yeah sweat okay yeah sweet is like uh, sugar sugar is sweet for example or uh, good people, I mean, uh, some people are sweet, yeah, it's like, yeah. So, sweat, wet, and ream with, rhyme with wet, with wheat, goodness. <laughs> I don't see wheat very often. Wheat is like uh, when we eat cereals. Dang, ping, uh, spitting illegal facts reported. Okay, now, now, <laughs> now we've got the three... A true report. Uh, thanks for telling me. Uh, I will try to learn or at least rem remember. I'm getting smashed here, goodness. And uh, thankfully, we're getting a lot of hearts. Ah, that's nice. That will keep us safe here. Okay, we're done. So now we feel a little bit more healthy. 
stage 3 at the moment, but we are at the... near the end. Oh! Bad move. I was trying too hard here. Yeah, so this one... And Bionic Commando, they are among my favorite games uh, on NES that are not turn-based RPGs. Oh yes, most definitely those games are good to me. Let's fight him differently here. Let's cheese the game! <laughs> <laughs> Goodness. What's pink weapon? Um, pink Puff doesn't have a personalized weapon yet. But you have the Giggle Grenade. Yeah, he looks like Shredder for sure. And here is the Joker. <laughs> you look at my latest work of art. Yeah. Stage 4. I rarely do that. I'm just uh, a little lost with uh, the strategies here in this stage. Will something go get out of there? <laughs> Save the queen. <laughs> Goodness. It's the Joker. Hit him. <laughs> Save the Queen, is it from Final 8? I remember that weapon. That's a nice name. Maybe Final 8, I, I don't remember. From a lot of Final Fantasy games, that's for sure. Pink Puff likes Final Fantasies. What was uh, that not a weapon response? Yeah, it is. Uh, uh, it's at least in tactics. Save the queen. Hmm. Was it in more than just tactics? Which predates eight, yeah. Didn't get into tactics. I played both. I completed tactics, but um, fate didn't want me to complete eight yet. Just because I lost my save twice, you know. But I, I really like uh, Final Fantasy VIII. Uh, retro achievements will certainly make me play this and uh, complete this when I'm there. But it will take a long time because I'm playing the shorter games. And Final Fantasy VIII is certainly a lot. Uh, I mean, um, let's call it a massive set for sure. Just like Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, pe people say that uh, maybe in Final Fantasy VII we need to do se uh, four runs of it. That's too much. Too much for a set. Uh, that's not how it should be done. Probably one run if you do things correctly, but not four. Sorry. Yes, it's uh, in at least tactics. Eight and nine. Probably a bunch more by now. Save the queen. Yeah, I'm trying to remember where, where I saw it last. I know that I wielded, uh, I wielded something like that before. Hmm. I know that I... Mm, maybe it's tactics. For, I mean, when it comes to my memory. But I played 9 after tactics. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Holy sword. So you don't get it at the very beginning, I guess. <laughs> I guess. Okay, let's see how we we fare against those. 
walls here. I don't remember which path is the, be the best for us here. Let's try to use this one here. Does it work? He pushes down. Okay. Um, what did I miss here? I think I could do that uh, safely there. It was an unprecedented crisis too. Mm -hmm. But uh, that's not the one that I remember in my uh, mind right now. I don't even remember uh, for when uh, I got... Oh, I... maybe you're right, Pink Puff. I, I, I know that uh, you, you know about unprecedented crisis. I mean uh, that you're right about the fact that Save the Queen is there, but I think it's where I remember wielding the sword for the last time. But you know, it's... Um... There is still fog in my memory about this one. Okay, I know what I did wrong there. Ah, goodness. Sorry about that, I just messed uh, totally there. Yeah, like this here. Now we will be fine. I'm very rusty. Normally I would go there uh, in another way and uh, without uh, losing time. <laughs> now it's like, uh, goodness, getting older with those games. I have no practice. And it's fun, I mean, seeing myself go back to um, the drawing, drawing board. <laughs> it, I think it's the one you get from Yang's side quest. But, uh... Save the Queen. Was it something that Yang was using or was it for another character? Because uh, to me, uh, Save the Queen, I would give it to uh, a swordman, not Yang, but uh, maybe it's just me. Oops. Ah, it was for the Paladin. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Excellent. Destroy this one. Oh, that was quick. So that was for Cecil. Yeah, unprecedented, unprecedented crisis was very fun, Pink Puff. Final Fantasy IV Ultima. Brave New World for my Final Fantasy VI is great as well. Return of the Dark Sorcerer for Final Fantasy VI as well. Of course, the Vanilla ones. But I will be starting Final Fantasy V uh, in the next months. Will depend uh, when I start it. But yeah, it's um, need to complete the one that I'm working on at the moment. Tough one, but very fun. Didn't really struggle. It's it's more than um, I prepare myself. I I, uh, I do a lot of work uh, and grinding, so uh, we are feeling like we're very ready for each fight. It's just about uh, getting the right strategy if it's needed. Um, that boss kind of reminded me of the Arius 3 boss in uh, Blaster Master. Yes, absolutely. That's uh, very similar. Pretty much. But here we, are, we have two of them. Though in the hack that I did for uh, Blaster Master, I put two bosses in the same room. I mean, uh, twice the, the cube. So we, we, we have two at the very beginning if we fight it in the first room where we can see them and that's that's pretty fun because uh, that's the only boss with whom we could we can do that <laughs> that's tougher but um uh, there, there are two of them but their hp is split between the two so it's like uh, if the the one in the original was taking i don't know uh, I don't know, let's say 25 hits, here it's uh, 12 and 13, you know, it's like uh, it's split between between both. And when one dies, the other one dies. Yeah, but it, it, that was the only thing that I could do because the game editor was limited, so I did the only thing that I could do, which was trying my best. <laughs> yeah.
Okay, let's burn ourselves. <laughs> okay, we're getting there. I see, that's not so bad. No, that's fun. And uh, also, um, if there is anything, people can still find the other room where there is only one of them. If uh, two of them is uh, too scary. But they need to um, to be um, to there because if they don't, it will not work. Okay, here uh, it it's asking me to be um, a little bit careful, I guess. Yeah, two different bosses room, absolutely ping puff. And when you get the item, uh, that's the hover. Um, the bosses will not be in the boss, uh, the other boss room. At least that's what we get. The only thing that can look weird is that when you kill both uh, the, the, the where I mean when you kill the ones that are together in the same room, you will have two hover items uh, when you complete the fight. You touch one and you will get it, and uh, the other one will just disappear. But yeah, that's uh, that's how it is. Here yeah, I'm not taking any chance because we're on the verge of dying, so I'm just doing things uh, the way that they are the, the safer, the safest. Yeah, it's always the same pattern, so it's... Uh, but uh, and, and of course I'm used to that, uh, but I can remember a time where... I don't know, I was stressed and I was getting... Uh, not getting the jumps at the right time, so I was getting hit a lot. Okay, let's go. Here is the Joker. Let's see what he's got. Oops. Yeah, he's got a strong weapon. <laughs> One more hit and we're... I mean, from it, and we're dead. Or from anything now. Oh, will we survive? <laughs> I didn't jump! My, my, uh, I pressed the button, and it was like... Um, <laughs> I don't know how to explain that. Sometimes we press the button, but... Um, we're like... Uh, not stuck, but... I don't know how to explain that. <laughs> that was funny. I know that it wouldn't jump in, in time. <laughs> But no problems, is uh, it is... Yeah, the gun is very long and it's powerful too. E10 input. Oh, maybe, uh, Climax, I don't know how to... Yeah, maybe. And with that pan, it does it uh, the way it jumps. Because there is a small delay when we jump. And I, I knew that we were to die. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> Stuff happens. Take this. He's dead, he's dead. More than dead. I know you murdered my parents, now you will dance with the devil in the pale moonlight. Goodbye, Joker. Ethan input uh, seems to be pressed the button, but nothing happened. Um, well, yeah, but n I didn't press totally. But uh, it, it was like the next time that I would push, it, it wouldn't it wouldn't work. But um, it's, it's hard to describe because I'm not looking at the controller when it happens. It's rare, but it just happened. It, that was fun. <laughs> Not an excuse for the death, it's just funny. <laughs> the more I die, the more the funnier it is. Uh, when was the last time where, when I died and I got frustrated a bit? Could be when I played Star Tropics 2. Ah, uh, that was annoying because there was a long boss rush. And uh, did everything that I could against a dragon. But I was not fighting it the right way. Was not jumping to uh, get the damage to his head. And I was fighting there for pff, minutes and minutes and minutes. I did the best that I could, but I, it would not go down and I would just die at some point. You know, you can't always avoid everything. So, yeah. Uh, but when I knew how to do it, uh, at last it, it worked. I started Star Tropics 1 a while back, okay, and couldn't figure out how to progress past the first town uh, what do you mean you couldn't figure out how and where exactly climax was it uh, in the fighting zone or something makes me curious there uh, let's use some music here We 
should not be very loud, but it will be there. You start in a town and I was stuck in it. Oh, you need to speak with everybody. <laughs> but you didn't get the sword yet. Uh, yeah, Super Metroid in uh, Married, yeah. Yeah, exactly, Ping Puff. So I will spin the wheel. Uh, it's up to you to play or not play. Um, I don't judge, of course. It's not uh, for everybody. Some people like it. Some people, you know, they are there for the gameplay. Um, let me at least spin it. Let's see what we, we've got. Sorry, sorry about that. Uh, okay, spin the wheel. Let's go. Who knows? Some, sometimes other people hear it. We'll count plus one. <laughs> okay. Let's add it to my notes. Count plus one. And uh, Blue Moon Jackpot. Oh, that's interesting. Uh, we'll, we will just need to roll dice here. And uh, the jackpot uh, is worth 13... Oh, I can. We can see it there. Uh, jackpot, jackpot, goodness value, thirteen hundred and seventy-five moonstones. So one winner, boom, wins that many moonstones. Interesting. We'll show you the rules, and it's very easy. We will do. We would do two, two rounds with the dices. Let me show you the dices here. Uh, yeah, so I will roll a dice. Yeah, it's a dice 20 here. And uh, if people want to try, they need to roll a 6 to win the jackpot. It's, it's, a, it, uh, it's that simple. So you roll a dice 20 whenever you want. And uh, good luck. You need a 6 to win the jackpot. So who is in? Just tell me you're in or just roll the dice. There is no problem. <laughs> Let's go with this. I will give it a good minute. And uh, if there is nobody, it's, it's like uh, we don't have any player today. <laughs> no problems. <laughs> But the possibility to win more moonstones for redeeming stuff is there. And uh, since we picked the blue moon jackpot, it's mean, it means if we have no winner, we still add 250 to it. So I will write it down right here. 30 seconds if uh, anybody wants to try. There, I will go see if I can raid somebody. Goodness, a lot of people, a lot of people are playing at the moment. Goodness. Okay, we will be raiding the gaming chef. Goodness. He's playing um, Shining Force. That's a game that I don't know much about. So, and uh, it's been. I heard about it, so I, I want to see it at the same time. And it's been a while since I raided uh, the Gaming Chef, so let's just do it. So, thanks everybody. Today, uh, we that was cool. We completed two more games out of the 20 that we picked for this week. So that means, if I'm right, 13 of them are remaining. We have 3 days to complete 13 games. And some of them are long. That will be interesting to see what, what happens there. I will just set it here, here uh, in the ending soon layout.
So that was very cool, and we also showed today a certain strategy to beat uh, at my weapon at the end of the first world in Final Fantasy VI Royal New World, and uh, that was something. I mean, uh, using step mine at its best <laughs> was uh, different, I would say. <laughs> so, cheers, guys! Have a good rest of your day. Sending you to the gaming chef. Goodbye.